A suspension bridge is a type of bridge in which the deck is hung below suspension cables on vertical suspenders. The first modern examples of this type of bridge were built in the early 1800s. Simple suspension bridges, which lack vertical suspenders, have a long history in many mountainous parts of the world. This type of bridge has cables suspended between towers, with vertical suspender cables that transfer the live and dead loads of the deck below, upon which traffic crosses. This arrangement allows the deck to be level or to arc upward for additional clearance. Like other suspension bridge types, this type often is constructed without false work. The suspension cables must be anchored at each end of the bridge since any load applied to the bridge is transformed into a tension in these main cables. The main cables continue beyond the pillars to deck level supports and further continue to connections with anchors in the ground. The roadway is supported by vertical suspender cables or rods called hangers. In some circumstances, the towers may sit on a bluff or canyon edge where the road may proceed directly to the main span. Otherwise the bridge will usually have two smaller spans, running between either pair of pillars in the highway, which may be supported by suspender cables or their own truss work. In the latter case, there will be very little arc in the outboard main cables. The earliest suspension bridges were ropes slung across a chasm with a deck possibly at the same level or hung below the ropes such that the rope had a catenary shape. The Tibetan Siddhar and bridge builder Thangthong Gyalpo originated the use of iron chains in his version of simple suspension bridges. In 1433, Gyalpo built eight bridges in eastern Bhutan. The last surviving chain-linked bridge of Gyalpas was the Thangthong Gyalpo Bridge in Daksamen, route to Trashi Yangtze which was finally washed away in 2004. Gyalpa's iron chain bridges did not include a suspended deck bridge, which is the standard on all modern suspension bridges today. Instead, both the railing and the walking layer of Gyalpa's bridges used wires. The stress points that carried the screed were reinforced by the iron chains. Before the use of iron chains it is thought that Gyalpo used ropes from twisted willows or yak skins. He may have also used tightly bound cloth. The first iron chain suspension bridge in the western world was the Jacobs Creek Bridge in Westmoreland County, Pennsylvania, designed by inventor James Finley. Finley's bridge was the first to incorporate all of the necessary components of a modern suspension bridge, including a suspended deck which hung by trusses. Finley patented his design in 1808 and published it in the Philadelphia Journal. The portfolio. In 1810, early British chain bridges included the Dryberg Abbey Bridge, the first important modern suspension bridge. The first chain bridge on the German speaking territories was the chain bridge in Nuremberg. The Clifton suspension bridge is one of the longest of the parabolic arc chain type. The current Marlow suspension bridge was designed by William Tierney Clark and was built between 1829 and 1832 replacing a wooden bridge further downstream which collapsed in 1828. It is the only suspension bridge across the non-tidal Thames. The Sicheny chain bridge, spanning the river Danube in Budapest, was also designed by William Clark and it is a larger scale version of Marlow Bridge. An interesting variation is Thornewell and Warham's Ferry Bridge in Burton-on-Trent. Staffordshire Thick, riveted together. The first wire cable suspension bridge was the Spider Bridge at Falls of Schoolkill, a modest and temporary footbridge built following the collapse of James Finley's nearby chain. Bridge at Falls of Schoolkill. The footbridge's span was 124 meters, although its deck was only 0.45 meters wide. Development of wire cable suspension bridges dates to the temporary simple suspension bridge at Annanay built by Mark Sagin and his brothers in 1822. It spanned only 18 meters. The first permanent wire cable suspension bridge was Guillaume Henry de Foss St. Antoine Bridge in Geneva of 1823, with two 40 meters spans. The first with cables assembled in mud air in the modern method was Joseph Challey's Grand Pont, suspended in Fribourg, in 1834. In the United States, the first major wire cable suspension bridge was the Wire Bridge at Fairmount in Philadelphia, Pennsylvania designed by Charles L.A.J.R. and completed in 1842.
It had a span of 109 meters. Elert's Niagara Falls suspension bridge was abandoned before completion. It was used as scaffolding for John A. Roebling's double-decker railroad and carriage bridge. The Otto Bate Bridge was the first modern suspension bridge outside the United States built with parallel wire cables. Drawing of the Tibetan-built Chuxam Bridge south of Lhasa. Constructed in 1430, with long chains suspended between towers and vertical suspender ropes carrying the weight of a place.